Okay, this is the candy dispenser, and this right here is the gate tube. This is the ramp on top of the gate tube. There's the hole right in this part. The marble is going to come down the regular ramp here, land on this ramp on top of the gate tube, drop into the hole, fall to the back of the gate tube. This is going to drop down. It's on a fulcrum. Uh, the, the fulcrum is on top of a a box. It's a little hard to see, but there's a um, a piece of cardstock that's hinged here and here, or I mean, it's glued here and here. It's a hinge, so you can kind of see, you know, that this is moves up and down like that. Uh, when this drops down here, the back of the tube is going to lift up, and the candy is going to come out of the gate right there. It's going to fall down this ramp and land in this little dish right there. So I'm going to demonstrate it to you. And there the candy fell into the dish. I also want to point this out. Um, when the gate tube falls down like this, it has to have enough space above it so that it can um, go all the way up and expose the gate. This is the gate opening right there. This is the ramp behind the gate. That's at about a 45 degree angle. There's a shaft that's one and a half inches square that goes all the way up to the top of the box right here, uh, right up there. And uh, it's, it's on the inside of the Cheerios box. And then there's this ramp, of course, that comes out of the, the gate opening. Um, put this back down like this. Now, as you, as you notice, it, it doesn't hit anything up here. It doesn't hit anything here. And it's, it's, a little away from, it's a little away from the side of the box so that it's, the box itself isn't going to stop it. It just goes like that.